Oh, you're in for a doozy today, people. <laughs> Welcome to this hot thing brought to you by X Triangle Triangle L Compass C Studios. It's a little doozy of a game called PlayStation Home. Oh, that's... <clears throat> Go ahead and change the lettering so it says that. Yeah, these uh, these loading times leave a little to be desired. Well, it's a brand new game. Leave it alone. <laughs> Came out in what, 2012? <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. And what, what we checked it, it did come out like a couple years ago. Yeah. You showed me this last session and you're like, oh yeah, this is great, great. And we left it like eight years old. <laughs> Launch title for PS2. <laughs> How it slipped under our radar for so long, I'll have no, I have no idea. Why are you shirtless? Because we still have our, our Hellman that I put together last time. Oh, ho, ho, ho. <laughs> I forgot. However, I think we need to make a, a custom uh, person. Yes. I believe the the wardrobe is also where we go to make changes to the, the face and bones and skin. Oh, you can change his bones? Sick. <laughs> Yeah, you can give him, you can uh, call a hotline, give him new bones. They'll also take away the old ones for you. So do we want to make a? Do we want to make a man or a lady? Let's make a lady. Loading preset. Well, you, the game, you know, once you load that preset, we're gonna fuck it up pretty hard, right? We're gonna wreck it. And there's there she is. There's your average lady. That's too average. Oh yeah, my. <laughs> I remember I pointed this out last time. My favorite thing about this menu: there's torso, legs, full body, torso, legs, torso, legs, feet, torso apparel, leg apparel, tights, and garter. Nice. Hey, where do I make changes to the to the structure? I can't remember where to go to change the the bones. Don't either. I thought you'd think it'd be somewhere there. Well, in a couple of hours when this finishes loading, I can check the pause menu again. It just, it actually just the other day pushed through an update for this. And so I was curious. So I was like, what the actual fuck are you updating? <laughs> <laughs> and I looked and it's like added new light cycle mini game. I'm like, do you guys are like they're still supporting this thing? We get a clan on here going. <laughs> if you guys have a PS4, this game's free, yeah. Yep. Just do a meetup. Oh, here we go. And I'm just letting you all know now. We tried to make a chocolate man. It ain't happening in this one. Oh, because oh, it. Ah, <laughs> oh, no! Take it away. Put it away. It's too. There's good things in this world, and that's not one of them. <laughs> Nightmare fuel. Well, let's see. We can make a um, a blue dava dee dava day. I I kind of dig in that blue. It's a, it's a strong blue. That pink looks good too. That hot hot pink. Like somewhere in there. Yeah. That. <laughs> Just <laughs> she's all pink because she's so flustered. Oh yeah, she's got. Oh, she's got to be a tall lady. The one really tall. Yeah. Ooh, do we want like really like ripped, like defined muscular? Not really. I'm not really seeing a difference. No, not really. Just gonna add some like shading on her arms, basically. Sure, we'll make it our buff, bitch. Let's see. Well, what, uh, what's, what's, what are we kind of thinking for proportions overall? Are we thinking like big lower body, small upper body? Oh yeah. Let's see what that looks like. <laughs> but before that, belly or no belly? She's gotta have a gut. <laughs> oh my god. That is quite the disparity in arm sizes. Those are some long arms. But I kind of like tiny hands. 
baby hands, yeah, because it looks like they're just like the arms fell off. They're like melting. <laughs> There's <laughs> some nice wide hips. No, we want that gut with them tiny ass hips. <laughs> well, first off, there's age lines, which on this type of like skin palette, I don't think really is gonna do much. Unless you crank it, and it's like super fucking wrinkly. Well, there's something interesting happening with the forehead there. I think it's the hairline. <laughs> like growing the hair, the forehead. <laughs> You need to go with like a bright color or a white or something to really make them pop. Yeah. Strangely, unibrow not an option for the female avatar. It would be. You wouldn't get these things going though. But are they th are they like thick enough? <sighs> that is also a good point. Because from the lighting, at least from my angle, you couldn't really see them. Like, I can see them, but they're not prominent like they should be. Yeah. Like, we want people to see from, like, halfway across the bowling alley that this girl's, like, she's got, you know, she's got some follicles up above her eyes. Those are looking all right. Ooh. Angry or a little bit worried? I don't like the angry look. Yeah. I mean, yeah, if I was stuck in the game that <laughs> had such long low times, I'd be angry too. Not as much going on with the eyes as I thought there would be. Right? Ooh, those piercing blues, though. Ooh, that, those are popping out real good. Ah! And some of these sliders don't really seem to do much, except for that one. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Dear Lord. This, this one, I don't know, having that all the way in really, I don't know, it gives me like a, some kind of like Uncanny Valley vibe. <laughs> I can see that. And then just like, and you move those suckers way out there. And it's like she can see the whole bowling alley, the whole world. Or she could just see you. Ear shape? Oh yeah, we can do a little... We can do some little, like, elven ears, I guess. We need the big old fucking honker ears! Then we can bring those bad boys out like a couple of wings. Hey, Bear, the girlfriend and I just went and watched Dumbo the other day. <laughs> also, don't go watch that movie. Not, uh... Not a particularly good one. Michael Buffer is a sellout. <laughs> Michael Buffer is in that movie. Uh. And he says the phrase, let's get ready to Dumbo. And I wanted to fucking walk out. Because <laughs> he said it twice. Ooh. Oh my we god, get, those are bright. We can get really bright with the lips. Holy shit. Those are like glowing. Oh god, that blue kind of hurts a little bit to look at. I kind of like it, though. <laughs> ah. It's very, it's, it is very striking. I'll give it that. Right now, that looks like sucked on a hard candy. It's like, ugh, like a lemon. Ugh. I don't know what jaw bite is, but it did something. Fair enough. <laughs> Wait, moving jaw down makes mouth open? You can move it all the way up and give her a little bit of an overbite. <laughs> This is nightmare fuel at its best. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that chin's going away. We've got to get to the. We've got to get to the hair. Now we do. Not not many choices. To be fair, oh, we, we can make it funky looking. Oh, we can get a little get a little fresh, get a little hip. Actually, don't mind that. <laughs> so, ah. uh, <laughs> Hides the ears too much. Yeah. About that. Uh, yeah, I mean, you get a little bit of it poking out, but you kind of... Those ears don't get too much time to shine behind that hair. <gasps> three distinct hair colors? Why three? And why does this... 
Oh, this first one is changing the undercut. That's why. Okay. Jesus, that blue, though. I really like that blue. <laughs> wow. Now what can we do for makeup? Oh, my God. So Ooh. many options. <gasps> oh. Fuck <laughs> 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 even is that? The eyelashes have become God. And have transcended through the hair. I don't like that, but then we have to make it like an ugly ass color. I honestly need the most elaborate one. Yeah. Our girl takes her time. <laughs> I mean, this one here is pretty elaborate. She's drawn little, like, DNA strands or constellations or something. Fair enough, that'll play. And now we have eyeshadow. Which apparently also has three distinct colors to it. Jesus Christ. That is a cloud ass. Pit. Oh my goodness. <laughs> There's so many options. Okay. Now we're on to the blush. Add a little contour to the face. Ah! Oh! I kind of like that. Yeah, and that's kind of kind of popping. Alright, and then there and there she is. Is what's her name? What's what is her name? Because there's nowhere to actually input it. What is uh, well, what is what does she look like to you? What's what comes to mind when you look at this this handsome lady? We get another quick close up of the face. I gotta I gotta, gotta study the subject. She's like she's a little bit she's a little bit otherworldly, little alien, but she's trying to rock it nice with the new hairdo. And she's trying to fit in. Yeah. What's another name for what's another name for space that can be construed as a a human's name? Her name's for space? Like uh or like things in space, like uh like a like a nebula but she's like Debula. Deb yeah. Debula it is. Okay, and you see she's got her nice like kawaii girl t-shirt so she's gonna she's gonna really make a lot of friends I just realize the name of the game is fucking nebula god damn it <laughs> oh nebula meet nebula okay so where's the first batch of cool friends we should try to hang out with bowling alley <laughs> hit up the bowling alley yeah, because there's there seem to be like a few clicks out here already, and you know it's tough to get into one when it's already established. This guy's just kind of skating around. <laughs> OG gangsta. Oh, baby! You looking at the king? Flirting with boys again? <laughs> well, he said, "Hey, Davila," all in all caps. I'm telling him, "No need to yell. We are indoors." <laughs> <coughs> I can hear you perfectly fine from here. <laughs> Could have said my boy. <laughs> Quiet, my boy. My, <laughs> my good, good, my good, good OG, OG gangster. Who's a good gangster? You a go <laughs> I have a pet. I like Pepsi. And then that's when we do a little dance. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Debula. <laughs> you so crazy. Let's see. What do you say? Should we hit up the the club? Oh, yeah. We'll get our dance on. And yeah, you know, Debula's itching to, itching to get them dancing feet moving. Got them happy feet. She got that big old gut. She's ready to strut. After her. 900 light years of waiting, we finally loaded into the dome. Oh my goodness. <laughs> well, there's actually a surprisingly decent crowd in here. What's the ultimate, uh, what's the, what's the goal that Nebula wants, or Debula wants to achieve in this earthly, earthly realm? Counselor here, but on her home planet of Venus, I suppose. <laughs> Third funnier name here. Uh, she is a salesperson for 
bubble gum. So she's going to use her bubble gum selling skills <coughs> to resolve family conflicts. Absolutely. So, well, she came to Earth. She tried to be somebody's counselor. But just everyone was in too much of a good mood tonight. Nobody needed one. Drama here on this Earth. <laughs>